Okay, good morning, Figaholic friends. Today is April 1st, 2020. Happy April Fool's Day. Um, we're being foolish, I guess. And um, Well, I'm not being foolish. I'm letting my worker do the hard work here. But we're taking soil samples now. Our leaves, our figs, rather, are putting out quite a few leaves. They're not mature yet. We're not going to do leaf samples yet. When we do leaf samples, uh, maybe in one month, we take this second youngest mature leaf. We don't have any mature leaves yet. They're um, still expanding. A few varieties might, but we want a representative sample. What we're doing now is soil samples, and this is done once a year. I probably haven't done it for a couple of years, though, because we're not trying to maximize our crop production, um, and the economics aren't there for that, but um, what we're doing this year, too, is taking soil samples at two depths. Um, we're going to take um, in, in ten locations throughout the fig orchard, we're taking a soil sample at zero to eighteen inches deep. Go ahead and start, Luis. Um, I have a soil probe and then we're taking, and that's going in the orange Home Depot bucket. Um, and we then also do a soil sample at zero or 18 to 36 inches. Um, I've sometimes theorized that, well, in fact, I know from a soil test done years ago that there was some salinity issues. We put a tile line in the orchard um, last May. Maybe it was done in April, I forget. We had a really wet year last year. This year has been dry. We have irrigated one time um, this year, but now we're getting some rains and it's not too critical yet, but I didn't want the soil to be depleted. So he might hit in a root this time, so he might need to pick a different spot, but because um, um, it, it gets tough, but um, so we're looking to see what the nutrition level is in the top 18 inches. And, you know, many people give, oh, what's, you know, they give general fertilizer recommendations. It really depends on your own soil. And um, we try to avoid um, getting um, weeds in the soil sample, so we clean the soil around the probe. But um, then looking to see down below 18 inches if we've got some salinity issues and if so we'll continue flood irrigating like I showed in a video last year that we're trying to push salts through the ground but this gives you an idea we need to push the very plug there get, gets um, filled in the end there it's hard to get it out we've got to push it out and so here um, for now we're just doing the 0 to 18 inches and then in the blue bucket we'll show further. So um, I'll report back later on the soil results that we should get in a week or so. Um, and then again maybe in a month we'll do some um, leaf samples. Um, we have other crops that we're doing today and we'll also do again in a month or so and I'll report back on that. Thanks for watching.